That should be outlawed. That's horrible. Things to cook with. Cookware. Heard of it, but never used it. I'm just kidding. I can make pasta. And by make pasta, I mean boil water and then put the pasta in. <laughs> She's a chef. Oh my god. Why? Hello. So I'm back at it again. The Sims 4, but every room is a different. But today I'm doing a repeat. Many, many months ago, I did The Sims 4, but every room is a different color. This is a really simple, easy, basic one, but it's very effective and it's very fun. And it's kind of like doing the solid color build challenge, but each room is a challenge. So today I'm going to be using this beautiful house I found on the gallery from Shiba Sim Sim. It is so cute. Look at how freaking cute this house is. I'm gonna just ruin it. <laughs> on the inside, it's gonna look so bad. But it's such a cute house. Three bedrooms, two baths. I figure this is a really good amount. All right, the house, stunning. Look at how cute it is. The backyard is so cute. Beautiful landscaping, very colorful perfect for this video. So I also have all the colors right here that we can sort by in the game. I made a little wheel of fortune here that we can spin and see what we land on. So the first thing I have to do, oh no, it's so pretty in here. Oh, I'm gonna ruin it. <laughs> this is so sad. I'm gonna have to take away all of the decor. Now you might be asking yourself, why didn't you just download the house unfurnished? Because you can do that in the gallery. Well, you see, um, The Sims likes to do this thing where it just glitches and half the stuff from outside gets deleted because it considers it as furniture. I honestly don't even know, honey. I don't even know. I'm not mad, I'm just disappointed. Let's start in here. This was the study. So let's see what color the study is. Also, I I must have deleted the door on accident because there's no way to get in there. So let's do this now. I'm so freaking nervous. Thank God I have my coffee. Spin the wheel. <laughs> Starting off strong. Woo! Sort by pink. Oh my gosh, yes. Oh, I'm already excited. So let's start with the wallpaper and the flooring. Okay. Okay, so I might go with this flooring. Oh, you know what? Actually, that one's kind of cool. Oh, you know what? No, that's actually good. The problem is that it's like the shades of pink are not gonna match up and that's what bothers me. Mm, it's bad, but that looks nice. Oh, actually there is a pink window. That does change the outside. You know what? That's okay. That, that's okay. We'll change the windows if we can, if we can. So now it was a study. So let's go ahead and get a desk. Not a lot of pink desks, but there are some. Oh, there's this desk. I love this desk. It's so cute. Oh my god, there's actually a pink computer. Well, you had me fooled. I thought there wasn't gonna be anything. All right, a bookcase. Yes, sir. There you go. <laughs> Let's get like a little place to sit down, maybe. Tons of pink chairs. So, so many options. One might say too many options. Why are there so many pink chairs? I'm not mad about it, but I am curious. Where are there so many? It's weird. Are there any plants? Oh my god. Oh, she's huge. Uh, maybe something a little smaller. That'll work. That's cute. Do something like that over there. Oh, or even this. Why is it so shadowy over there? Maybe that'll help spruce it up a little bit. <laughs> Are there any activities that we can put down? There's a flower arranging table that's pink. There's a guitar that's pink. That's kind of cool. Not a lot of stuff in here to do that's pink. Pink. There's this thing we can put on the wall. That's actually kind of cute. Washers and dryers. I'm not sure if you want that in your study. <laughs> I can put this here like it's the CPU, even though that's clearly a laptop and that's whatever. <laughs> can also put that. Oh my God, that's so cute. Wow. I need some more like decor items. Here's a box of crap. <laughs> It really is just a game of what can I find, you know? That's really all it is. Oh, maybe a rug in the middle of the room. There's a unicorn rug. Oh my God. Yes. Maybe some like pink curtains or something. Why do these never quite work? What's up with that? What is up with these curtains? Oh, forget it, man. You're not getting curtains. If you're gonna be that complicated, you can forget it. Well, all right, I think that is pink room number one. So now we have to do the great, great shame of removing pink from the running. Goodbye, pink. All right, the next room we're gonna do is the dining room. So that'll be kind of this whole like main area. I think I'll stop the wallpaper here. You know what I might actually do? I might take like a little column and put it right Right there to kind of separate it. When I zoom in, they kind of go away, but you, you know, we know they're there and you know, just for fun. So for the dining room and this like front little area, what do we got? Oh, that's kind of 
interesting. Black. Okay, there are many different directions that this could take. Let's see what they got. Let's do wallpaper and flooring. This is gonna be really easy. There's like so many we can choose from. <laughs> what if I go for something like this? Like this hexagon type of flooring. And then right here, I'll just make a little diagonal. Honestly, proud, proud of it. All right, so there we go. Now we need some wallpaper. Okay, uh, we could just do solid black which makes it easy. We could also do something a little more fancy if we wanted to. There's a lot of stuff from vampires that is black that we could use, or a little more spoopy. I might just go with a solid black, to be honest. It's gonna probably be easier. All right, let's see if we can find some curtains for this one. Oh my God, we could cover up the whole thing like it never existed. I don't know about all that. Do they have something that's like a little longer that we could use? I don't wanna cover it up. <gasps> there we go. Can I make this black? No, they're all black. They only have a dark brown. So I guess that's just what we'll have to go with. This is a dining room after all, so let's go ahead and get a table. Oh, what the heck happened here? We do have room for quite a long table. Ooh, this one is so nice. I, I always use this table. Yell at me all you want, but I love it, man. It looks so good. It's chef kisses. <coughs> Chef's kiss. Delish. Some black chairs. They are very fancy. Next, let's get a black rug. I'm hoping there should be something we can use. Oh, there you go. Oh my God, that looks so good. It looks so sleek, doesn't it? Now we need like a centerpiece. Oh my God, this plant is so sick and it comes in this too. That looks freaking awesome. <gasps> oh, it's, oh, it's so like mysterious. Oh my God, I love it. I love it, y'all. All right, we need some other things for a dining room. We need some artwork, some stuff to hang on the walls. Oh, this is perfect. Okay, one of those, that's great. And then then what else could we do for a dining room? I would say just maybe a nice painting would be good. There's also these. We could just make it a whole menu. And you know what? I might just do that. There you go. <laughs> Beautiful. And we need some stuff for the walls over here. Unfortunately, there's like no room to put anything really. So I'm just gonna have to make some space for some paintings. So like you and you, you're good. <gasps> Here we go. There's really only one painting that's black, like fully black like that. I'm just gonna go with it. And then I'll just put down a runner and call it a day. There we go. Looks nice. Now let's move on to the kitchen. And kitchen time. What are we cooking in? Oh, this is gonna look like black and white. <laughs> All right, so gray. We need to do flooring first. Maybe we could do like a tile. Uh, gray, like this. Okay, or like that. Or maybe that. Maybe we could do that. It's got a little bit of white in it, but I think it's okay. And then for the wallpaper, I'm thinking something really simple like this will be fine. I'm also gonna take another one of these columns and separate these rooms because they're kind of open. And then this will make gray. Perfect, there's a window that's gray. Beautiful. Well, hopefully this isn't too hard. I feel like this should be easy. Gray is a pretty common color. I'm not thinking we'll have too much of a difficult time. All right, so I have this idea in my head. I'm gonna make it kind of fancy. Fridge right there. I'm gonna do like a double oven thing. So really fancy. And then I'm going to put Put a sink right in front of the window, which I adore. I always think that's so cute. And then I put this island in the middle. So it's like two islands kind of like facing back to back. <laughs> so not enough room for bar stools or anything, but I felt like the middle was kind of empty without something. So I just went ahead and put that there. There we go. We got some cabinets. Now I'm going to put like a vent hood thing above here. I'll just use Old Faithful. There you go. We can put a microwave. We have room for that. Oh, maybe. Oh, there we go. <laughs> that like wouldn't work. You know what? Maybe I'll just put it over here. We do need a trash can. Oh God, this trash can's huge. Maybe there. It's going to kind of go into the living room a little bit, but it's okay. It's fine. Now for some decor. Here are some things to cook with. Cookware. Heard of it, but never used it. I'm just kidding. I can make pasta. And by make pasta, I mean boil water and then put the pasta in. <laughs> She's a chef. What else can I do? Oh, I can put this by the sink. A little drying rack. That's kind of cute. What else? What else? What else? What else? There's gotta be some more kitcheny things in here that are gray. There has to be. Here's some flowers. I mean, that's kind of cute. Wow, there really, there really isn't much. <laughs> There's not much in here, y'all. Oh, what about one of these trays? Ooh, it's not really gray. I don't even know why it's showing up in here, but I'm gonna put it there anyways, because it needs something. Y'all need something. Maybe I can find more in here. It's a lot of bathroom stuff, but I'm gonna look anyways. Maybe I can make it work. Oh, here we go. A little like a display. That's kind of cute. And then maybe if I can find like a little plant, that would be good. You know what? The plant didn't work over there, but maybe it'll work here. There we go. Right in the middle. <laughs> You'd never know that I cheated that in. Now, I know for a fact that there's like silverware that you can put on the walls, but where is it? You're telling me that's not considered gray? It's a fork and a spoon. They're practically- There it is! 
Oh my god, I knew it. I was like, do not lie to me. Oh, you know what's actually even better than that? This. That looks great. Okay, great. That's the kitchen. Actually, I think the kitchen looks really nice. <laughs> I'm kind of shocked. So moving on to the living room. We have this big old space. Let's remove gray. And what shall the living room be? Please be a color. Oh, I shouldn't have asked for a color. I should have asked for a shade. Yellow against all these muted colors. That's gonna look crazy. Oh my God, my eyes. My eyes. <laughs> it hurts. <laughs> it hurts so bad. Oh, no, the flooring. Oh, I'm gonna have to have yellow floors. <gasps> that should be outlawed. That's horrible. That's awful. That's worse. <laughs> oh my God. I blacked out. Oh my God, there's actually yellow TVs. <laughs> there's this. Can, okay, can, can you cut me some slack? And can I just put in like a regular TV? Because TVs aren't gonna be yellow, you know? They're just not gonna be yellow. But everything else I do will be yellow, okay? Just let me have that one thing. Look at those little shelves. They look super cute. Now I need things to put in the shelves. How am I gonna do that? And also, what am I gonna put in the shelves? A ball of yarn? Nice, you can't even see it. <laughs> it looks like a lemon. A megaphone? Sure. You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just gonna put a megaphone in there. What else can I put in these? There's, so oh, a trophy. Perfect. Love that. Okay. I do feel like I need something underneath. <gasps> I know what I'm gonna do. I know exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put those little Ottoman babies underneath this TV because I think they look so cute. Yes. Yes, honey. Yes. Now I need a couch. <laughs> oh, hopefully I can fit all that in here. Oh no, I didn't. Whoopsies. I forgot about a couch. <laughs> I'm just gonna go with this one because I know there's a matching couch. That's the only reason I'm choosing it because I don't have to think about it. I just know that there's a matching couch and that makes me feel so much better inside. There we go, a table. Let's put an end table. There are not many that are yellow. I can only imagine why. A lamp, okay. There's a lot of yellow lamps for some reason, so that was pretty easy. I do need something for the table though. Oh, perfect. Perfect. And I need a rug. I'm not excited. I'm not looking forward to this. <laughs> not looking forward to this one at all. Oh, a solid yellow rug. Oh my God. <laughs> that's so lucky. All right. That's looking pretty cute. What else can I fit in here? Some artwork. We need some art. Oh, some portraits in yellow frames. <laughs> I know they're supposed to be gold, but they are the same color as the yellow wall. So, yep. Oh, perfect. <laughs> oh my God. That's a lot of yellow. All right. Well, there you go. There's a lot of yellow. Oh my God. I actually feel like it's missing something though. I feel like it needs some like tall plants. Are there any? Oh, I guess there's these. Kind of felt like it needed something. Well, there you go. Anyways, moving on. Uh, we'll just bring it into the hallway. I feel like it's such a tiny little space. It doesn't really matter. All right, so let's do the first bathroom. They've laid this out in a way that I can understand. So let's delete yellow. And what are we doing for the first bathroom? <laughs> Red, oh God, red for a bathroom. Okay, oh my God. Just hurts my eyes when it's all in the same place. Uh, a red flooring, is there a red tile? Oh my God, why? <gasps> I don't like it, I don't like it. This should be fairly easy though. So long as there's like red of each thing. Oh my God, is that really what I'm gonna have to choose? Well, that's black, that's pink, that's, I guess that's technically red. I'm gonna have to go with this one. This one looks the most red. And then next to it, we're gonna have to put a sink. And then there's supposed to be a shower here. I assume this is the most red looking to me. There you go. It's so dark. I think I might've deleted a light on accident. Put a light over the shower. And then I need a mirror, which, oh, that's huge. Let's use that one. Is there any toilet paper? There's not, but there is a hand towel. And then all we need left is like some other things for a bathroom. Maybe I put the broom here or no, maybe I should decorate it nicely. <laughs> this is terrifying. If that was in my bathroom, just watching me do my thing on the toilet, I would not be happy about that. All right, there's a painting. Oh, I, I didn't paint this wall. Whoops. There you go. <laughs> that was fast, but pretty simple. All right, so it looks like this is the master bedroom. It has its own master bathroom. And then this one is like a secondary bedroom. So maybe a kid's room or something. So let's do that one first. And then we'll leave the master bedroom and bathroom for last. So let's remove red. And this will be for the secondary bedroom, kid's bedroom maybe. Blue, okay. Blue is good. Oh my God, this room is already blue. Whoa, what are the odds, dude? What are the odds? Okay, I'm gonna make it really over exaggerated though. So I'm gonna add in a really vibrant color and then also I need to do the flooring. Oh, Lord help me. Whoa, that's bad. Okay, maybe, oof. I might actually go with that. When I say I hate it with a burning, raging passion, I really, really do. Is there a blue window? Oh my God, why is there a blue window? The outside of that house is, it's not looking so good. <laughs> I, I've changed up a lot of the windows and whoo, it's suffering. All right, so first let's go ahead and get a bed. This will be a kid's room, right? So 
little kid bed. That one's cute. Actually, that, what, that matches the window perfectly. Weird. Okay, let's put that there. And then for an end table, hmm, that? <laughs> it almost blends in so well. It just vanishes. Oh, we can put a little puppy behind it or maybe above the bed. And then on here, we can put like a little piggy bank. What if I put a lamp there instead? So this room looks really dark with all the blue. So I think we need to brighten it up. Just anything with light, anything. There you go. And then the kid will need a dresser. Perfect. Great. Actually, maybe we'll put that over here. We do need some artwork in here, but we also need toys. And I'm scared that there isn't gonna be anything good. Oh, okay. There's a Blarfy. That's good. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, wait, you know what? This one's even better. It's like a little treasure chest. Unfortunately, there isn't really a dollhouse that's fully blue. This one's black. It's not really blue. But we can do the little like puppeteer thing over here. I might actually move this and just put this here. And then we'll move Blarfy like maybe over here. I think we could scoot all this stuff over, have some room. Or we could put Blarfy over here. No, they can't get to anything. Eh, this is fine. We'll put some other little things on top of here. Little gnome guy. <laughs> and I don't know if there's a rug that'll work in here. Maybe. I kind of need like a runner to work in here. Oh, <gasps> perfect. It's like a fuzzy rug. Oh, cute. Oh, I really like that. Oh, that worked perfectly. Oh my God, I thought there was just gonna be no rug. And maybe some snowflakes. <laughs> because I can't think of anything else. But there you go, there's the blue room. Now moving on. Oh wait, there's another bedroom. Oh shoot, I totally missed it. Let's go ahead and do this one too. That's gonna be like a teenager room or something. We'll figure it out. We're running out of colors. Oh, <gasps> green. All right, green it is. Hey man, green would have sucked next to blue. It would have been way too much. We can do a similar thing that we can do like the same carpet and then that. I actually don't mind that. I don't think that looks too bad. It's not terrible. What color looks the best? Maybe that one. Is there a green window? Why is there a green window? It has almost every color in the books. <laughs> it needs a bed. Ooh, this room's kind of small though. So if I do anything, it's gonna have to go here. So I'm gonna need the room. This one actually puts off a green light, <laughs> which makes it even worse, but it's kind of funny because it's so exaggerated that I'm I'm kind of into it. <laughs> Here's a rug that fits pretty well. And then if I can fit an ottoman at the end of the bed, I will do so. If not, I'm just, just gonna leave it. Oh, there we go. That works. Now I need a dresser and I would like to put a desk in here if I could. I don't know about all that though. That does seem like a stretch. <laughs> None of these dressers really fit, man. Let's just like scoot that one over as much as possible and then see if we can fit a desk in. Like one of these little ones. Are you kidding me? That's the color it comes in? That is so bad. That's not the right color of green. Oh my God, there's a green laptop. There's a color laptop for everything, honey. Actually, that looks fine. And then we'll put some artwork above it. That'll be kind of cute. Maybe like a poster. There's like a football poster. Oh wait, there's like a whole, oh my God, it's Tinkerbell. This is like what my bedroom looked like. I had Tinkerbell posters. <laughs> I did and I would do it again. Here's like some crystals. There you go, have fun with that. We can put this above the bed. It's just really something. <laughs> Really something. And then I need something right here. Maybe that's from their school, perhaps. I don't know, making this up as I go. And there we go, I think that's it. I think that is a good green room. It's actually not a bad room, but it's green. So, all right, now we're moving on to the master bedroom and the master bathroom. So let's do the bedroom first, we'll remove green. We're, we don't have that many colors left. Light brown. Okay, we'll just have to see what this game considers light brown. This looks like a beige to me, which is funny because that's kind of the color it already was. But I kind of, oh God, I don't like this color at all. Woo, this might be the worst one. I hate it, dude. I just hate that so much. <laughs> all right, that looks good to me. Is there a light brown here? Eh, kinda. I should just, I'll just keep it brown, whatever. All right. So, master bedroom time. What beds do you have for me? Oh, this one's kind of perfect. Or maybe this one, so many options. Oh my God, why is that coming that color? <gasps> why? Let's do that. I feel like that one really gets it. It, it, it fits in, you know? <laughs> oh, I really don't like this one. Mm -mm, this is this is not it. This is just not it. Not to be dramatic, but I hate this. Oh my God, that rug is like the same color as the floor. Maybe this one's a little bit better. I actually really like this rug. It fits in there a little bit weird, but I'll do the ottoman thing at the end and hopefully that'll fix everything like it normally does. Yeah, that looks nice. Now I need a painting to go above the bed or multiple paintings, a thousand paintings. We need a dresser, a lot of choices here. Actually, that one's kind of cute. I haven't put a single mirror anywhere. I just realized that. Now it's time to shine. <laughs> we'll put a little chair next to it. I love this mirror. I do, I just love it so much. Some paintings there. We got a little seating area over here. Maybe a plant. This plant makes many, many appearances in this home. It's just, um, it's a good plant. It comes in every color. 
It's wonderful. All right, I think I am done with this room. It is time to move on to the final room, the master bathroom. And I love how they've done this. That's like where the bathtub goes. So good. All right, there's only one, two, three, four, five, six colors left. What will the master bathroom be? Oh my God. <laughs> Why? Wait, black's still in there? Oops, I forgot to take black out of there. My bad. But hey, we didn't land on it, so whatever. Purple. Oh my god. Are there any purple bathroom items even? Is this gonna be a flop? Oh yeah, that hurts my eyes. It does. Tile flooring. Oh my god, there's really nothing except for that. I'm not using that. You couldn't pay me to use it. I'm using that. That's... Wow, I felt my, my eyes like singed. <laughs> <gasps> There's no shower or bathtub or toilet. Dude, what? How am I supposed to do this exactly? Right. Well, I'm gonna move the door over there and I have a plan. I am going to make like a little area here for sinks. I think this is how they had it. And I guess I'm just gonna take purple off and just try to get as close to it as I can. That could be purpley. So could that. Maybe we'll just use that. And then for a bathtub, we may just have to use a good, good old regular bathtub. There, there's blue. That's pretty pretty close. Okay, might just go for blue. I know it's not right, but I'm trying. <laughs> there has to be something that looks purple with the showers. There has to be. This is The Sims. Anything is possible in this freaking game. There's blue shower again. Okay, that one's the same shade of blue over here. Just let me have this one thing, okay? I'm sorry. Oh, wait. You know what they might have done? Hold on. I still don't think there's gonna be a purple in here, but maybe they put the toilet over here. You're telling me there's no purple toilet? I just find that so hard to believe. Okay, that looks kind of purple if you squint. So we're gonna do that. And then over here, we'll put like one of those cute things that you always see. These things. Oh my God, they're gorgeous. Guess and there's a purple one. I love them. I just love them. And I feel like I never get to use them. So I'm always so excited when I do. Now we can put a plant to fill in that space and act like it just never happened. We can put this above the toilet. We can put, oh God, this is not in a good spot. We'll put that right below the window. Is there a purple window? There's a blue and we're gonna go with it. <laughs> Purple towel over there. Put some purple flowers there as well. And then we need a mirror or mirrors. That's not great, but it'll get the job done. And then I would like to put like a little rug in here. It's just something. Hey, this rug's kind of cute. It has all sorts of colors in it, but mostly purple. I know I kind of screwed this one up. There wasn't really a purple. Maybe I'll just make those black, just blend them in. But I tried my best. Oh my God. This house looks crazy when you look at it from this angle. That looks insane. <laughs> This looks crazy. Look at all the colors. Well, that is my solid color home. It's kind of beautiful in a way. <laughs> in a really, 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 really weird way. I like it. <laughs> if you enjoy these challenges and you want to see me do some more, leave a like on this video and comment down below what you think I should do next. If you're new here and you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button down below. Stick around. Watch me torture myself in this game. We have a lot of fun here. <laughs> To become part of the early squad, click that notification bell and make sure all notifications are on so you never miss any of my videos. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I'll see you all very, very soon. Bye-bye.